friends, this is the Miss Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead, and it's Meatless Monday, except that it's Wednesday. This is how you can make a delicious meal meatless. I'm going to use this to boil spaghetti noodles. I'm going to use this frying pan to stir fry some broccoli and some onion. Um, and then we're going to get creative with yogurt, hemp hearts, and Parmesan cheese. Just because it's meatless doesn't mean it can't be a really delicious meal. Now, I was doing my Patreon live stream and I was talking about what I was making for supper. And they said, no, do a video. Because this started out, this started out as just noodles with Parmesan cheese and butter. All right. And then it developed into, you know, it's a, a fast meal. It started out as like a quick lunch. But when you, you know, it's just kind of grown from there. Now, I'm not saying you can't have meat. If you got some, you know, chicken or whatever you want to dice into it. But the whole point of this is uh, making a meatless meal. Because God knows the prices of meat right now are nuts. I should be turning on my frying pan. And I'm going to, you can't see what I'm doing, but I'm not moving the camera. So I'm just going to give the frying pan a little bit of extra virgin olive oil. Now I could use my zucchini that I have in the freezer, but I still have a little bit of broccoli, frozen broccoli left. And once I open that bag in the freezer, I really don't want to let it sit in the freezer open even if you close it once it's opened it kind of starts to deteriorate so get these onions in first uh, it's not going to hurt to use lots of onions folks onions are a vegetable and they are a flavor enhancer okay it's now really let's get the while your frying pan's heating up now you crush your garlic, you use powdered garlic, granulated garlic, whatever you want, but Howie and I like garlic. We hear our frying pan starting. You can use any kind of vegetable. I just happen to have my last broccoli. I want to talk to you about my next ingredient. These are hemp hearts. Okay? Oops. These are hemp hearts and you can get them at Costco. There's about $15, but look at what's in these. Uh, shelled hemp seeds, what's the serving? Per three tablespoons of hemp hearts gives you 10 grams of protein, 9 grams of omega-6 polyunsaturates, and 2.5 grams of omega-3 polyunsaturates. And that's, that's just three tablespoons. I give us a half a cup per person. This is going to take stir-fried vegetables and noodles to a whole other level. This is really, really good for you, and all it is, it's like having crushed nuts, but they're not hard, they're softer. Really, is a wonderful product. If you cook these, they will lose their, some of their nu nutritional value. So always use these as a garnish on top of food. Briar puts it on pizza, we put it on everything, noodles, salads, everything. Oh, they're wonderful on a salad. Now, we want to leave the, we don't want to overcook these vegetables. We just want them to be, we want still, we still want some crunch to the onions. We don't want, you see how nice and green that is? We want that to stay like that. So, we've turned it right down, and I'm going to put a lid on this. And I'm just going to turn it right off, and then we're going to cook our spaghetti noodles. All right, my favorite noodle, 
to use for this is spaghettini. Gives the satisfaction of spaghetti, but it cooks faster. And don't don't give me crap for breaking the noodles. That's just it is what it is. So we're just going to cook these spaghettini noodles, and then I'm going to make magic happen. Okay, here is our drained noodles. Just a little glob of our spreadable butter. Now this is plain yogurt. Much healthier, much less fat than sour cream. Add a bit of yogurt in there. You can do sour cream or you can do just butter and milk. All depends on what you got in your fridge. And there's Gracie going for a drink of water as if she might, as afraid she's not going to get heard on camera. I'm going to dump some of our creamy. Whoa, that's a lot. I'll go half a cup of hemp hearts. These are really good, folks. Give that a little shake down there. Some broccoli and onion. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Now, on goes. About a quarter cup of Parmesan cheese. And the yogurt and the Parmesan cheese and the hemp hearts is where we get our protein. So we're just going to do this. Along goes the pepper. Let's see what Papa has to say about that. My hair. She likes the smell of your hair. It's Meatless Monday, dear. It's Wednesday. Well, <laughs> pretend. I've dressed up our, this is our uh, pasta and parmesan supper. Mm. There you go. Mm -mm -mm, broccolis. Broccolis. And I remembered when you wouldn't eat them when we first met. Mm -hmm. This is the Mrs. Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead saying just because it's meatless doesn't mean it can't be amazing and healthy too. Mwah. Take care. God bless. <laughs>